For the first time in 30 years, Lynn County reappraised property values, and values mean many businesses will end up paying more taxes. The new assessment has both commercial and industrial property up more than 17 percent. The chief deputy assessor said a majority of the increase was due to higher land values. The last reappraisal, that was back in 1983. At that time, Lynn County's commercial and property value was just over $700 million. Well, 30 years later, it's increased to just under $850 million. Property owners have until May to challenge their new assessments if they disagree with the reappraisal. After much debate, European leaders agreed today to a debt bailout to save Greece. Eurozone finance, finance ministers have promised the equivalent of about 170 billion U.S. dollars that they will give to Greece. It's the ambitious program with a clear focus on competitiveness should really give enough space for Greece to restore its competitiveness. The second time the Eurozone has bailed out Greece. The money will give the country some short-term relief, but it comes at a difficult price. Greece will have to reduce its yearly national debt by 40% by the year 2020. Greece is in its fifth year of a nationwide recession. Well, with news of that Greek bailout, American stocks surged today. Former First Lady Laura Bush is there ringing the opening bell to what many are calling a great day. The Dow surpassed the elusive 13,000 mark. The last time we saw that, May of 20, 2008, it was really a huge psychological boost that investors are feeling better about the economy. But the Dow was not able to hold that level for long. It dropped back down to just under 13,000 at close. Tomorrow, the Treasury Department will unveil a new corporate tax plan. The Obama administration is predicted to propose lowering the 35% corporate tax rate. At the same time, though, he's expected to also eliminate loopholes and impose a tax on American companies' overseas profits. President Obama broadly outlined this plan during his State of the Union address last month. Coming up, a big night for the big school girls. The Class 3A and 4A girls punch their tickets to state. John and John will have highlights next. Stay with your 24-hour news source, KCRG TV 9. While the nation